current time is 7, 17 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. This transmitter is operating under a limited product suite due to hazardous weather potentially impacting the area. Routine programming will resume once the weather threat passes. The following statement is, for the following area, in Oregon, Central Willamette Valley, dense fog advisory in effect until 1 p.m. this afternoon, air stagnation advisory now in effect until 4 a.m. Monday. What, for the dense fog advisory, visibility one quarter mile or less in dense fog. For the air stagnation advisory, a period of stagnant air with light winds is expected. Where, Central Willamette Valley, when, for the dense fog advisory, until 1 p.m. this afternoon. For the air stagnation advisory, until 4 a.m. Monday. Impacts, hazardous driving conditions due to low visibility. Air stagnation can result in the development and persistence of poor air quality. If driving, slow down, use your headlights, and leave plenty of distance ahead of you. People with respiratory illness should follow their physician's advice for dealing with high levels of air pollution during periods of stagnant air. State Air Quality Agencies highly recommend that no outdoor burning occur and that residential with burning devices be limited as much as possible. According to State Air Quality Agencies, prolonged periods of stagnant air can hold pollutants close to the ground where people live and breathe. Check with your local burn agency for any current restrictions in your area. The following statement is, for the following area, in Oregon, South Willamette Valley, air stagnation advisory now in effect until 4 a.m. Monday. Dense fog advisory now in effect until 1 p.m. this afternoon. What, for the air stagnation advisory, a period of stagnant air with light winds is expected. For the dense fog advisory, visibility one quarter mile or less in dense fog. Where, South Willamette Valley. When, for the air stagnation advisory, until 4 a.m. Monday. For the dense fog advisory, until 1 p.m. this afternoon. Impacts, hazardous driving conditions due to low visibility. Air stagnation could result in the development and persistence of poor air quality. If driving, slow down, use your headlights, and leave plenty of distance ahead of you. People with respiratory illness should follow their physician's advice for dealing with high levels of air pollution during periods of stagnant air. State air quality agencies highly recommend that no outdoor burning occur and that residential with burning devices be limited as much as possible. According to state air quality agencies, prolonged periods of stagnant air can hold pollutants close to the ground where people live and breathe. Check with your local burn agency for any current restrictions in your area. Hourly weather observations at 7 a.m.